Today, I will tell you about a very useful fertilizer for almost all plants. It is especially suitable for vegetable crops that form flowers and fruit starting from the lower tiers of the plants, and then, as the plants grow, the fruiting shifts to the upper tiers. These plants include our beloved tomatoes, eggplants, cucumbers, and peppers. During the period of mass fruiting, when the fruits on the lower tiers of the plants are already ripening and the upper ones are just forming, vegetable crops need more potassium, calcium, phosphorus, magnesium, and microelements than, for example, nitrogen. Therefore, for fertilizing my plants, I will use wood ash, which is rich in almost all macro and micro elements except nitrogen. I use wood ash to fertilize all my plants throughout the season because wood ash contains all the substances in a form that is easily accessible to plants. To enhance the absorption and uptake of these beneficial substances, I prepare an ash decoction and conduct foliar feeding. Here's how I make it. I add five liters of water to a five gallon bucket and bring the water to a boil. Then I add about one kilogram of ash, stirring and cooking the mixture for about 20 minutes. After boiling, I let the solution cool, then strain it through a sieve covered with cloth or gauze into another bucket, topping it up with clean water to make 10 liters. This solution contains all the beneficial macro and micro elements in a form easily accessible to plants, positively affecting flower and fruit formation. To enhance the effect, I add one teaspoon of boric acid to the ash solution. Boron is essential for good flower formation and improves fruit setting. You can use this fertilizer both as a foliar spray and by direct application to the soil. Use a sprayer to evenly coat the leaves of your plants, making sure to cover both the upper and lower surfaces. Apply early in the morning or in the evening to prevent sunburn on wet leaves. Adding a surfactant or a little liquid household soap helps the solution adhere better and longer to the leaves. For direct application to the soil, simply pour the prepared ash solution around the base of your plants, ensuring thorough coverage of the root zone. Alternatively, you can mix the ash solution with water in a watering can and apply it to the soil as you would with regular watering. This will allow the plants to absorb the nutrients through their roots. This fertilizer promotes better flowering, new fruit formation, and good development and ripening of fruits. I advise all gardeners to use this fertilizer on their garden crops. If you found this guide helpful, please like share and subscribe for more gardening tips.